All right, uh, I'm back on the trap line. <laughs> Haven't been able to get a video out for you guys lately. Uh, everything's been real busy for me uh, between work and trapping. Most of my time I've been checking traps at night. So uh, it's real hard to get video footage, but um, today's Christmas Eve. It's about, I don't know, 10 o'clock. Uh, I'm gonna check some traps. Uh, I'm gonna be, uh, I got a fox snare right down in here. I already caught two fox out of it. I'm doing pretty good for my first season though, but uh, so we'll go down and check in. Not sure if anything's gonna be in it, but I just gotta put some more lure out and uh, I'll meet you guys down there. So uh, I'll see you in a little bit. Alright guys, coming up to the set. Um, got it right back in this brush. And, uh, nothing in it today. But uh, you can see that this has been real torn up. There's the snare right there. And it goes back up into there and the fox right around in here. But I'm just going to rebait this, uh, this little limb right here or re-scent it, re-lure it. If I can get this lid off. Ah. Alright, I'll just be back with you in a second. Alright guys, so uh, all I do is I'll just take a little stick or whatever. Do, uh, put it up in there, pop it out, something like that. It's good. Um, I've been using this, uh, this Cavins Minnesota Red Red Fox Clan Lure. Uh, it's actually been working pretty good for me. Stuff reeks though, but that's good. So uh, yeah, alright, let's go on to the next spot. Alright guys, we're back. We're about half mile away from that last set. Um, I'm down on uh, on the side of a bridge, you can see. I got a couple coon sets here, so... Uh, uh, there's probably not going to be anything in it today. We had a big, uh, big snowstorm yesterday, or a big rainstorm. We had all this snow. And you can see, everything's watered up, but you can see how the, usually the river is out on the side of the bridge and then they have this trail right through here. So I had a snare right there. And uh, it's just, uh, it's it's cabled off to a cinder block with the quick links. But uh, I usually had, uh, I had, I don't even know if I can cross it to show you the other one, but I had some muskrat carcasses just sitting right here, but uh, you can see it's all flooded over, but I don't think there's anything in that one, let's see. Yep, nope, there's a snare right there. Cabled off to there again, but nothing in today. I didn't think there was gonna be anything. I think I pulled three coon out of this spot alone, which is all right, but, and, oh, and a possum. But, uh, so all right, I'll meet you guys at the next spot in a little bit. Just wanted to say that uh, today's like a real beautiful day here in New Jersey. Too cold out, real nice sun shining, good Christmas Eve. We just had uh, probably about eight inches of snow between the last week or whatever. And uh, had a big rainstorm yesterday, and uh, now it's all gone. It warmed up real like a lot the last couple days, too. That's why I've got a couple coon traps out, but uh, it's starting to get a little bit colder again now, so uh, we'll see at our next location if we have any. See you guys a little bit. Alright guys, we're at our next location. It's a pretty big swamp. I got a bunch of muskrat traps out and mink traps, so uh, we'll go take a look around, see what we can find. Um, I got a pond up over uh, over there that I caught a couple muskets out of. I'm not sure what the deal is because there's like this one pot but I don't know why I'm not catching any out of but I did move one of my traps yesterday and, and then I got back over here you can see I got a, I got all that land out there. There's a big stream that runs through it. She owns half of this, half the swamp and uh, caught a bunch of muskrats out of there so I'm not sure if I have anything in it today but Yep, so uh, I'll meet you when we get to the first set. Alright guys, um, this is what I was talking about before. I mean, I'm not even sure if it's a muskrat house, but I found a hold for it the other day, so I stuck a conibear over it. So, 
we'll take a look. I don't think. Uh, I think our trap is empty. Let me take a better look. Yep, trap's empty, so that's alright. We'll just go ahead and check down on the next one. Alright, see you in a little bit. Alright, guys, here's my next set. Um, I don't know if you can, uh, you can't really see the conifer in the water right there, but uh, I caught one out of here. I'm on like this little feeder bed or whatever it is. I'm not really sure. But uh, I've seen a trail over there, so I'm probably going to move it. I haven't had any luck here last week or so. So uh, I'll move it over there. I'll meet you guys over there. This, is, this trap is a Bridger 150. So. Well, what guys? Had two colony traps right there. Nothing in them today, but uh, caught a bunch of muskrats out of those. It's kind of hard to find. I know the muskrats are here. It's kind of hard to find them over there. Danning and stuff though, but. But, uh, so yeah, I got a couple more traps. Oh, I got one right here, too. Nothing in it. I'll show you guys it quick. Um, I don't know. I'm thinking, thinking that might, might have been a thin entrance to something, but I guess not. Maybe my trap isn't low enough. I don't know. But, uh, so I got... Another colony, another con bear right there, so let's go take a look over there. But yeah, real nice scenery out in the swamp. Real big, but uh, sorry. There's a lot of mink sign out here too, but I'm trying to uh, trying to connect with one of them. That's the only thing I haven't caught in this year yet was a mink. But nope, those traps up to two. There's nothing in there, nothing in the con bear, so. All right, well, uh, let's get going. I think I might have one more set around, we'll see, but uh, I got a, one, one more spot to check, so I'll see you in a little bit. Well, guys, I found this canoe covered up in the bushes with all grass over it and everything, so I said, what the heck, might as well uh, take it for a little stroll, so that's what I'm doing, but I'm about bringing it back, so. I'm trying to look for some more sign, but somebody brought their gutted deer back here and there's all the little pieces of running around. And must have been the mink or the raccoon or something, but uh, yeah, but just a beautiful day out. That's uh, that's for sure. Alright guys, back to it. 